You can walk in today and walk out with your tax cash loan. Rodney Salisbury is the man behind dozens of commercials, including Twix, 7-Up, Domino's, Burger King, a bunch of movies as well. And he's in town for book signing this weekend. Good morning. Good morning, Dave. It's nice to have you here. I'm glad to be here. Nice to hear your golden tones. <laughs> Thank you. Now, at what point in your life did you realize, hey, you know what? I'm going to be able to speak my way into a career. Wow, that's a great question. You know, I used to do a lot of singing, and I also did some acting. And along the way, people would say to me, you have a great voice, you should get into voiceovers. I didn't know what voiceovers were, I found out. I made a demo, back in those days I made a cassette, and um, got the top agent in town, and it changed my life. How does it work, say Burger King sends you a fax and says, here, describe the Whopper, mm -hmm. uh, and then you need to record it, send it to them, and then it shows up on television. How does that all come together? Well, it works like that sometimes, uh, but most of the time, I work on a thing called an ISDN line. Right. which allows me to work all over the world. I get up early in the morning, like I'm here early in the morning. From your house? That's from my house. And uh, the scripts are faxed to me. And I put my earphones on, and my uh, Telus Zephyr is plugged into the uh, ISDN line. My microphone is plugged into the Telus right. uh, Zephyr. And my headphones are on, and, and they direct me, and I, I talk, and they got it, and I go on to the next script. Some of the commercials here, right here. I'll listen to your voice for a second. Uh, honey? Honey? What are you looking at? Need a moment? Try the chocolate caramel and fresh cookie crunch of Twix. <laughs> I'm looking now, at potential babysitters. Are there babysitters. some where you just go, I am not saying that. <laughs> <laughs> I am not going to. You know, that's happened very rarely, you know, but it has happened. Yes, yes. What's remarkable, I think, and I'm sure most people do not know until this very moment, mm -hmm. that in The Lion King, there's mm -hmm. a popular song called Hakuna Matata, that's right. and you sing in that song. That's right, that's right. I'm part of... Uh, How did that come together? Well, I started, like I said, I started out as a singer, and I did a lot of movie soundtracks, you know, worked on The Prince of Egypt, too. And uh, one of the sessions was for Lion King, and I came into the studio, uh, and it was about eight of us, and we sang, and we had a great time. And I left, and I didn't think much of it, you know. <laughs> and then I got my first check, yeah. and I said, wow. Well, you said Hakuna Matata. Hakuna Matata. <laughs> I said, that was a big deal. There are some great voices in the business. Mm -hmm. uh, you hear the voice, you go, oh, it must be important. What are some of the voices that are important to you that have helped you kind of mold your career? Well, no doubt about it, we all love, like, James Earl Jones. Well, it's Darth you know? Vader. Yeah, Darth Vader. Yeah, that's a great voice. Um, and there's been some others, but I want to say that the beauty of voiceover is that anybody can do it um, if you have talent, of course, and if you work hard. And um, today they're looking for real voices. They're not necessarily looking for, you know, some great baritone or great bass. They're looking for people who can act because voiceover is voice acting. The baritone and bass, though, does help, doesn't it? Okay. <laughs> now, you'll be in Summerlin tomorrow. A chance yes. for people to come out and, and visit with you. Yes, yes. I'm going to be in Summerlin uh, signing my books, you know, uh, my first book. Uh, you can bank on your voice. And, uh, and your new, new one, Step Up to the Step Mic. Step Up to the Mic, uh, both uh, bestsellers uh, in my uh, voiceover community. And I'm going to sign the books, and I'm also encouraging people to uh, bring their demos tomorrow. And, um, you know, we will listen to them and critique them. So borders from when to when? From noon? Uh, no, it's uh, Barnes & Noble. Barnes & Noble. From 12 noon 12 to noon, 2. 12 to 2. Yeah. All right. And sometimes I'm encouraged to stay longer. All right, Rodney, in your most dramatic mm -hmm. movie trailer voice, mm -hmm. please announce Sherry for the weather. Coming up next is Sherry doing the weather. <laughs> That's good. Sherry, now I'm listening. For the first time all morning, I am now listening to your forecast. I